Okay, in the last video, I just talked about how to navigate our new My Language Labs. Um, I can show you some other features. The test, if you want to um, create tests, I think we go into My Test. Okay, and then you're just going to name your test. Says create new test, so I'm going to create a test. I'm going to call this um, explanation of test feature. You can call it whatever, um, and then you can just go under here and you pick test, um, and then you just hit create test. And then let's say I wanted this to be on um, chapter one, then I go into Um, I go into chapter one and um, I click that button and it opens up the various activities and then so then I decide what activities I want to add to my test and I will just click on the various activities you just kind of can scroll through here and that might be this might be a good time when you might want to look at the instructor resources so you could print off this stuff so you know what you're looking for because sometimes I find the screen a little pain to a little irritating to navigate, but I just click whatever activities I want, and I hit add, and then they're over here, and then I just hit save. Okay. All right, and then I can hit I can hit close and I'm pretty sure it's been a while since I've made one because I also keep just um, reusing tests. I, um, and I'll show you how you can do that. And so let's go back to the assignment calendar. And I think if I look under chapter one now, I'm going to find that test. Ah, never mind. Um, it's not there because I've got to add it. I've got to go into course materials. I'm sorry. After you create it, go into course materials, and then you want to add from library. And then I am going to go down and click my test folder. It should be in there. There's my explanation. Uh, oh, I didn't even spell that right. I'm sorry about that. Explanation of um, test feature and I click here and I add it and it will go into chapter one. So once it's added, it's in chapter one, but I haven't added it to the calendar. So then I go back to my calendar. And I scroll down and now it's in, um, it should be in chapter one because I pulled chapter one. So there it is, explanation of test feature. Then I can drag it over and put it on whatever day I want to assign it. And that's how you do the test. If you have a test from a previous um, semester, you can go under course material and you can do add from library and you can change your source. And so maybe you have an old test and you remember um, All right, I, maybe I have one here, I hope. Um, sometimes I forget. So I changed my source, and now I'm in that class, so I can look in my chapter one. On the left-hand side is the old course. Okay, so there, okay, so I do have, um, I'm going to pick this oral one, chapter one, and I would add that to, and I've already done, already done some of these. Um, let me go in and change my source again so I can add one that I haven't. Let's see. and see if I have anything, because uh, in level one, I don't do anything with chapter four, just so, okay. So I'm going to take this um, oral test one, chapter four, 
and I'm going to go over here and click on chapter four and I'm going to hit add and it's going to pull up this screen. Um, and then all you've got to do is go down to the bottom where it says add and close, click on that. And now it'll be in there. Um, and then, and so then when I go back into my, um, my assignment calendar, I'll be able to find that old, that test that I used in a different class. So if you don't want to change your test every single semester, you can use the ones that you already have created. Um, so now when I go into my assignment calendar, I can go down to chapter four and expand it. And there you'll find that oral chapter four that I just added, and then I could click it and add it to wherever I wanted to on the calendar. And that's how you do your test.